Hey there friends and welcome back to Strange Rebel Gaming, I'm Brianna White and today we'll be playing through another episode of Final Fantasy VII Remake, of course, but today's video is a really big one. It has this really big Aerith moment that I have just been dying to share with you all, so I hope you love it and uh, stay tuned, but first... I have to thank today's video sponsor, none other than our favorite, favorite, favorite Square Enix. I am always humbled to work with you Square Enix, so thank you so much for sponsoring today's video. So before we begin today's gameplay, support those who support this channel by clicking the link in the description below to learn more about War of the Visions Final Fantasy Brave Exvius, the latest tactical RPG in the Final Fantasy series. Now, we here at SRG love War of the Visions already. We've played it together before and it's super, super fun, but uh, they're celebrating their second anniversary since their launch, which is super awesome for them. There's no better time to check it out if you haven't gotten the chance to do so before. It's totally free to play, it's available on most app stores. And the reason why now is such a great time to check out the game if you haven't already is because of the Final Fantasy VI collaboration event. It runs between March 23rd and April 26th. And just for logging in, you'll be able to unlock lock for free. <laughs> Unlock lock. <laughs> there will also be awesome fan favorite characters like Terra and Celeste, and just for logging in, you can get extra bonuses like unit shards and Vizior and some other things too. I know I'm excited to unlock a bunch of new characters and see their gorgeous, beautiful limit bursts. I mean, come on. It's a Final Fantasy game, like, it's quality. If you haven't experienced this game's awesome story, trust that these characters, our twin princes and the steel maiden, with amazing voice acting, by the way, they're gonna take you on a great adventure. So click the link in the description below, download the game. Once again, it's free to play, and uh, support those who support this stream. Thank you so much to Square Enix for sponsoring today's video once again, and I hope everyone downloads War of the Visions Final Fantasy Brave Exvius to help them celebrate their second anniversary. And now, Let's get on to that gameplay video. Enjoy. How's about this? What are you? Johnny's in here this one with the dad. Hot damn, old dude. Did you make this one too? <laughs> now you see why all the ladies love and adore me? Tonight, you're with the VIP. I'll teach you all the right moves, all the ways to make them swoon. Yes, sir. I'll be your most loyal pupil. I swear it. Poor Johnny. I feel like he's such a lost soul, you know? I feel so bad for him. Okay, son, I found your dad. He was a mess, and it was not easy. <sighs> well, thanks for bringing him back. You're welcome. Can't imagine what you went through. Here, you earned it. Hey, you're coming, right, bro? Get ready for a real Walmart in education. I'm done with this. You, you can do whatever the hell you want. <laughs> I get it, bro. You're scared. It's only natural for people to fear the unknown. Uh. It's a pity you're not gonna join us, but I swear to you, bro, as an aspiring wall market connoisseur, I'm gonna go in there and get as much inspiration as I can handle for you, bro. For you. Because Cloud, you, bro. you are my one true bro. Oh my god. Honey, be in, here I come. Inspiration, here I come! <sighs> Perfect example of how age has absolutely nothing to do with maturity. <laughs> Couldn't agree more. Should probably go see Sam again. Poor Johnny thinks Cloud is his one true bro. Johnny, you sweet, sweet boy. No. Cloud literally just said, I want nothing to do with you. <laughs> Poor Johnny. Okay, uh, do you have anything more My to say? Is one amazing designer. At least he would be, if he ever actually did some work. Relatable. Do you have anything more to say? Huh? You wanna help us pick a dress? Alrighty. What do you think of this real skimpy one here? This silky one over here is kind of nice too. Oh, that must be nice. Hey, how's about this? What are you, crazy? This one's much better. Hot damn, old dude. Can you make this one too? <laughs> now you see what? Huh? You wanna? This silky so, one over here? So, if I remember correctly, he said. The girls at the Honey Bee Inn only pay him any attention because he makes dresses for them. Damn, old dude. You make this one too? It's terrible. And now 
We have to go see Chocobo Sam again. All right, Sam. I've done your manly night out on the town quests. They were annoying. So, tell me, what did you see in our little enclave of sand and debauchery? Bet it was an eye-opening experience. Nothing I haven't seen before. That it for jobs? Not exactly. I got one more favor to ask. You want to get teeth out, right? What's your angle? <laughs> Just get your ass to the Coliseum. You'll see. The Coliseum? Get me to the Honey Bee Inn! I gotta go back and fight things at the Coliseum? Ugh. There's more. There's always more. I'm just so excited to keep going forward. And I feel like these are just distractions. Alright. Do I have to talk to you? Hey, look, it's the champ! You know what to do. Take the elevator and head on down. I can't wait to see you fight. Okay. Also, just what is it? This quest is called a dynamite body. I'm curious. Very curious. Okay, so what's in store for us here? First, well, we don't need it, but can we really pass up an opportunity to sit on bench? Can we? I think not. <sighs> Thanks, bench. I love that bench. Bench love, for real. Bench is my one true bro. <laughs> okay, what do you have in store for us, sir? We've been waiting for you, champ. Um. Well, I don't really know what I'm supposed to do. I assume it's spe special match because Sam just said go to the Coliseum. He didn't really say anything else. But I'm kind of nervous. What's our materia like right now? Do we have cure in somewhere? We do. We have healing. Okay. Luck, refocus, HP up, barrier. We don't have any elements. I, I don't I don't really know what I'm in for here. Hopefully they're not immune to physical. Should I equip just one element, just in case? Like, replace luck? Although we did just put the champion belt on, so we might even want to lower our... We might not need HP boost. Yeah, let's just get rid of luck for now and throw fire on there. Just in case. I mean, I don't know, but... I don't know what we're in for. We've been waiting for you, champ. Stands are packed thanks to you. Now get out there and give him a show. He didn't tell us what to expect. Lovers of bloodshed and mayhem, your favorite champion, Cloud, is back in the ring. Do those look like right fire now, creatures to you? Hot, hot, hot. But look out, folks, because these dynamite challengers may just blow the champ clean off his throne. Cool. I hope you brought shades because you're about to see some fireworks. Okay. Fighters, begin! I guess I could have known from Dynamite Body. Okay. 
Okay. Where's my assess materia? No! I don't have it on. Oh, crap. Pressured though, that's something. Almost there, almost there. Are you staggered yet? You're about to be. Oh, come on! Uh, look how close it is to being staggered, okay. I'm gonna die. Can I use items in this guy? Okay, I can. All right, we're just gonna go for it. Come on. All right. Okay, in flame means. Well, I can be okay through. You're done. Okay, it's not going too terrible. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come on, I would love to just focus on one of them. Don't die, don't die. Okay, 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 okay. All right. Let's try that again. Yeah, all right, let's use Cura. Okay, don't just stand there, Cloud. I'm doing okay. In flame. All right, okay, let's get it staggered and then use our limit. Swell. Is it, is it like literally getting bigger? Like physically getting bigger? Cause I feel like it is. All right, we're gonna need a cure. Nope, get away. So let's use Cura. Yeah, okay, that was good. In flame. Let's hope we can get a stagger. It's probably gonna take one or two more focus thrusts. Hmm, let's give another focus thrust. It's like getting bigger, isn't it? Okay, it's pressure, that's good. Focus thrust. And then limit break. Wait, 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 I gotta choose which one. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah, okay, let's do Ascension. Let's do This is asshole. our first Ascension! Oh, it's so pretty! <laughs> Wait, that looks so cool! All right, well. That wasn't too bad. We literally had the opposite of everything we needed. But it was fine. He proved there's nothing more explosive than the guns he's packing. Okay, so quest completed, a dynamite body, nailed it. But then what? Like, why did Sam send us here? Just because he's jealous that Madam M nice going, supported Jeff. us first? You were in fine form today. Here's your cut. You earned it. Not here for the cash. Tell me about Tifa. Ah, Tifa. She's something of a bombshell herself, huh? Girl keeps in shape. And boy, does it show. Hey. Yeah. Just making an observation. Watch out, know? Sam. Anyway, seems like you're serious about getting the poor girl out of her predicament. I could tell easy enough by the way you fought back there. Cut to the chase. Well, you helping or not? Never said I would. Opposite, even. Getting mixed up in other people's business hidden my way. Plus, as you are now, I reckon you could ride to her rescue without anybody's help. And that's the truth. So what was you the money for? Since you first rolled into this here town. What is this whole money. conversation about? At any rate, I've said all I'm gonna say. You the said nothing! Ought to be done changing by now, am I right? She ain't no Tifa, but she is a firecracker. 
keep her waiting too long, and she might just blow up in your face. She ain't no Tifa. Rude. So now she, cho Sam specific, oh, bench. Sam specifically said, Aerith should be done by now. So I think we go back, I think we go back to Madam M's and see if Aerith's done. Okay, that's good on that. Or oh, how much skill do we have? No, we're still kind of poor. All right. We just spent so much money on that hand massage that now we're poor. Oh well. <clears throat> I think the music is one of the strongest points in this game that I, I wonder if, is it getting talked about enough? I feel like the music is amazing in this game. Not just, like, I feel like a lot of times in video games when they're like, oh, the music, it's so, you know, environmental and, and epic. This isn't just epic video game music. It's also goofy or silly at just the right moments. And it just, like, I feel like the music, like, puts a smile on my face no matter the song, you know? Or it, like, makes me dance like other video games. It doesn't have that element. So I feel like it's kind of underestimated, but but I don't know, that's just me. <clears throat> Maybe that's just me. Okay, we've talked about this, Brianna, you're poor. So we can't buy anything there. If you're that excited, maybe you need to calm down. Okay, we don't, again, no more shops, we're broke. Oh, don't need to go that way, we need to go this way. <clears throat> All the way over here. And it's gonna be easiest if we come through this little passageway. Have I talked to you? Oh yeah, you're the guy who's like, come on, come all, get shot out by this machine. I don't understand it. <clears throat> Check in on Aerith? It's time. No! Johnny, why? Cloud, finally. <sighs> Tifa, she... I, Tifa, she, she's, I don't. Take a deep breath. What about Tifa? I heard Corneo was gonna audition new girls soon. And Tifa's, Tifa's gonna be, I just, I, I don't know what to do. Well, I do. I'll come too. No, Johnny. Hey, Cloud, bro. Johnny, I no. Bro, right? You bro. ruin everything. You make everything just harder. Say, bro, that I'm totally relieved that you're looking out for Tifa. What is this nonsense? So like, oh my gosh. Anyway, I said. The way you fight, bro, is like poetry and violence. Bam, bam, whoosh, whoosh. Oh. You know? I really wish I could be just like you. My problem is that I tend to overthink and overanalyze. Is that your problem, so, Johnny? Bro, You're an overthinker? You advice for a smart stand-up guy like myself? No. Oh, come on, bro. Oh, now we're going through Wall Market. There's, there's more to do. What you got for me, Johnny? Well, this is it for me. Call me crazy, but uh, I have a feeling that I'll just be getting in the way. Oh, really? Go find Aerith at Madame M's. Tell her to wait for me there when she's done. Think you can handle that? He literally can't, Cloud. Yes, he sir. literally cannot handle that. Listen. There's two theories here. There, there's two, there's two important things to remember when you're a leader. You need to know what they're not capable of. Because, on the one hand, yes, it's Johnny's fault that he's incompetent. On the other, 
If you know he's incompetent and you still trust him with something, that's on you, Cloud. Oh, boy. So, last time we came here, there was a take over here, or maybe over here. There wasn't much to explore. <clears throat> and there is this little foyer in here. Now, I don't know... Here's, here's the confusing part. It's almost like it's trying to build tension. <clears throat> Excuse me. It's almost like it's trying to build tension because... This whole time you're like, let's see Aerith beautified. And then it's like, well, go do these side quests. And you're like, okay. You do these side quests and then it's like, wait, this side quest is actually going to be like eight quests in one. And you're like, okay. And then it's like, okay, go see Aerith. And you're like, yes, let's go see Aerith. And then Johnny, who says, Tifa, 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 makes you follow him here, gives you no more than that doesn't tell you what you're supposed to do here or why he brought you here and then he's like well i'm out it's almost like the game is intentionally written to build to that dramatic reveal it's well done because trust me at this point i'm chomping at the bit <sighs> now, what do you have to say, sir? I believe your name is Leslie? You again? Yeah. Got a letter of approval right here. Hmm? Huh? You know that's only good for women, right? Yeah, it's for Aerith. Who? Oh, that girl you were with. Sorry to hear that. Well, either way, you're stuck out here, pal. I can't let you in. I wasn't asking for permission. Huh? Wouldn't try it if I were you. Trust me, you don't want to screw with the Don. If you even think about causing any trouble, he'll make sure someone pays for it. And that someone might wind up being the girl you're trying so hard to break out. Or it could wind up being someone you've never even met before. Get it? You're in the Don's world now. Anyway, you've got some time yet. The audition won't start for a while. If you're sure you want to go through with this, then bring the girl and the letter. But if I were you, I wouldn't. Hmm. Anything else go to on, add? Get out of here. Go on, get out of here. No. Well then. I'm really glad I was taken away from Madame M's to come all the way here to get information I already knew. Isn't that nice? Now I gotta go all the way back. Huh? Hey, get out of the way! <gasps> Quit talking! Move it! Move it! Come on! Oh! oh my gosh, that's so extra! Fireworks! Johnny has a red carpet. <laughs> oh. And a version of her song. Oh. Hey, yeah. That's really. <laughs> yeah. Corneo's got certain tastes. This dress is so gaudy and impossible to move in. Uh, uh, yeah. Cloud? Uh, excuse me. Huh. He is hey, speechless. Did Johnny forget to give you my message? The one asking me to stay put? No, I got it. I was worried about you. I'm starting to think this place is more dangerous than we thought. Who knows what they'll ask you to do in this audition? No way in hell I'll let you go in there by yourself. By myself? Oh, don't worry. I wasn't gonna. Come on, you'll see. 
<laughs> She's what? so confident. Exactly. According to Madam M, you've caught the eye of a certain fabulous someone, and they'd like to meet in person. <gasps> huh? She joined our party again. She's so beautiful. <laughs> so, in one of the interviews that I did, <clears throat> or maybe it was on one of my YouTube videos. Yeah, it was on one of my YouTube videos where I, I did a collab with a bunch of other content creators and I asked, what's your favorite Final Fantasy VII remake trailer that's come out? And I said, the TGS trailer, where we got that scene in the trailer. And I'll be honest, I was so afraid that I was going to get one of Aerith's other dresses <laughs> and not this one, because I wanted to see this one in the game so badly. <laughs> because it's such a, such a, um, a moment that just takes your breath away just as you're watching it and, and it makes you think, wow, how far games have come, but also, wow, seeing this character in a completely new light in this complete transformation. And, and one thing that I also thought was so beautiful about what they did was, you know, when, when you love a character so much, you identify with that character. And so for every player that identifies with Aerith, that loves Aerith, they got to step into her shoes for a moment and have a red carpet moment with the paparazzi and the fireworks and and she's just had this big reveal like it's like a Cinderella story and so every player got to step into her shoes at that moment and experience that with her and I just can't imagine how much that must mean to people it was so well done. <laughs> and it was unexpected. Because you thought Aerith was going to be at Madame M's and you were going to have to go pick her up. So I knew they were building the tension, but I didn't know that they were going to drop it early on you and surprise you in this beautiful setting. <sighs> that scene was just so well done. And it just, it makes me so emotional. Especially because that was a scene in the trailer and I got to see that scene. Oh no, I don't have my tissues. Oh gosh. I got to see that scene so long ago and and we recorded those lines even longer ago. And so I'm like experiencing double nostalgia for that line where she says, Corneo's got certain tastes. <laughs> It's the most wild thing, people. It is wild. I don't know how else to describe it. It's just very strange. It's, it's beautifully strange. <laughs> oh, wow. So I just had to take a moment to, um, to process all of that, because that was just, oh, amazing. <laughs> Um, wow. I need to get my tissues. I, I usually have them right here at my desk because I, I am a crier. I have to be prepared. Wow. I am, I am flabbergasted. And of course, the first thing she says is, this dress is so gaudy and impossible to move in. She's thinking that she can't climb over rooftops and fight monsters in this dress. <laughs> of course. Oh, look how pretty she is. I love that dress. She looks like a mermaid from the back. Oh my gosh. But can we also talk about how this dress straight defies physics? You can't, you cannot have a strapless dress that is that low cut in the back because what holds up a dress is the waist part. <laughs> so in reality, that dress, if anyone has to cosplay this dress, I feel bad for them because either it has to come up in the back for support 
or it has to be literally glued to them. <laughs> oh man. Oh, yikes. Look at you all dolled up and fabulous. Where are you then? Don't objectify her! What? Say that again. <laughs> like that. You're still the most beautiful girl in the world. And I'm lucky to be with you. Oh, I can never stay mad at you. Oh, and they get a happy ending. That's nice for them. There's like, ooh, air it's pretty, ooh, air it's pretty, monster meat. <laughs> Classic comedy. Damn it. How many times have I struck out now? Many of our customers send floral arrangements to I'm walking really slow through this part on purpose just because of how pretty she is. I just can't help it. Also, she has three times as much hair as she did before. Oh, a poet has been inspired by her. This is it, your destination. The famous. Why are we here? To see the honeybee inns, Andrea Rodea, and convince him to give you his stamp of approval. You said you didn't want me going alone, right? Well, with Andrea's help, you can join me. It'll be fun. And honestly, I think you'll look pretty cute in a dress. What? <laughs> it's pretty rare for Andrea to take a personal interest in someone. At least, that's what Madame M said. Trust me, this is gonna work out great. Uh... Come on! Don't you wanna save Tifa? Wait. No can do, Cloud. This is our plan, and you'll learn to love it. <laughs> so, here's how I think we should approach him. Madame M said Andrea was a man who'd give anyone a fair chance to win him over. So I say we march right up to him, explain the situation, and see where that gets us. Sound good? Oh, that dialogue was so hard to record. It is so hard for me to maintain Aerith's voice while making super clean dialogue for a very long series of lines. That was so hard. But I just, I, I just loved how Aerith at this point in the game is like, Cloud, we're doing what I say we're doing. Get with it. Get with the program. <laughs> that I really wanted to get it right. Um, so I think let's try and talk to her. Come on! Don't you wanna see? Ah uh, yes, and then the manipulation. Well done, Aerith. Anything else? Come on! No. Don't okay. you wanna save Tifa? And in we go. Don Corneo presents, what is this? The Circus of Awe. Good evening. Welcome to the entertainment extravaganza that is the Honeybee Inn. We're here to see Andrea Rodea. You must be Mr. Cloud. He's waiting for you. Mr. Cloud. Mr. Cloud, <laughs> I've been instructed to send you through without delay, sir. Please, make your way to the stage in the back. What stage? The one in the back, sir. Straight through those doors and down the hall. Off you go to the stage in the back. What stage? The one in the back. Just like I said. Okay. So... I guess we just go straight through. Oh, I'm nervous. I dreamt of this moment. The honeybee in. Well, that's insane. Look at 
awesome! Just posing like that? Oh, wow. This is so extra. Now, look at all these rooms. What do we do with all these rooms? This is where we came from. So... Take. There's a... A sedative? What is that doing in here? What are you doing? Watch the stinger, sweetie. <laughs> what shape am I making? Mm. Johnny's father? What are you yes, doing sir. here? What is this? This is far too saucy for my tastes. Okay. I just walked into their dressing room cloud. Inappropriate. But we, of course, we're gonna look around now that we're in. It should be locked. Hey there, doll face. We've been waiting for you. Come on in, have a seat. No, I'm not here for... Huh? Oh, wait a minute. I think you might have wandered into the wrong room by mistake. I'm not here for... Doesn't say anything. <laughs> here for what, Cloud? Okay, let's try these other rooms. Wait, wrong one! Okay, let's try these rooms. <laughs> but now I'm in debt. <laughs> it's a very common problem. <laughs> I'm gonna get you. No, Palmer, no. <laughs> Is he dead? <laughs> He's winded. Oh my goodness. It's classic. <clears throat> okay. And what's behind this door? Oh, that feels amazing. Oh, acupuncture? Look at all the needles he has in him. No! Terrifying! Okay, well, <clears throat> that was exciting. Look at all those different rooms. I guess this is, is this the last room? We came out here, yeah, four rooms, okay. It's time for the extravaganza. And here's the man of the hour. Chosen by Andrea himself, our honored guest. Head to the stage. Off we go. This is your first time, right? It's okay. Do you want to practice your dance moves first? What? Why would I want to do that? Andrea thought it might be a good idea. Okay. Over here. Come on now. Hey, hold okay. on. Okay. <laughs> dance practice. Press the buttons in time to the music using the rhythm line as a guide. The colors and button positions on the guide panel show you which buttons to press. Watch the button positions closely and get ready to press them when the panel and line are right on top of each other. Okay, another rhythm game. Let's see how this one goes. I guess we're dancing with our swords? Ooh, go Cloud, get into it! Oh, I suck. Hold on, wait a minute. Whoa. I'm going too early. Okay, hold on. There we go. Go Cloud, get into it. Oh, use your sword. Wow. I just want to watch him. I don't want to watch the dance move thing. Work it, honey. Delicious. Perfection. 
Wait, I got too bad. Oh. I gotta do it again. You've got real rhythm, mister. Do Move I? over, girls. A new dancer's come to town. I'm gonna practice again. I gotta get all Take of them away, great. Honey. This is like DDR. <laughs> I feel like I would enjoy this more if I wasn't controlling it. Because I'm so focused on getting it right. Oh, that was gonna be a good, not a great. Oh, that's also gonna be a good. That's alright though. I think it's okay. All right. Eight and two. I don't mind it. I don't mind it. You've got real rhythm, mister. Wait, you said the Move same over, thing. Girls. A new dancer's come to town. I'm kind of confused, though. What are the honeybee's necklaces? Are they, like, bee fur? What's going on there? All right. Maybe I can do... Maybe I can do one more and try to get Grace across the board. Take it away, honey. Try one more. <laughs> Perfection. I have to enjoy it a little bit less to get Pretty grapes honey. across the board. Perfection. But you can't help it! It's infectious! I also like that Cloud would never do this on his own, but because I'm controlling him, he has to dance. We got the perfect 10! <laughs> Let the battles begin remake obtained. You've got real rhythm, mister. Move over, girl. Is that a, new is that a song? Do I get the town. song? And right there. Right there is where we're going to end today's episode. I'm so sorry we had to end it there, but of course there will be more goodness coming at you through the screen very shortly. Thank you so much for hanging out with me. I hope this episode pleased you. I hope it shocked and awed you. That's a thing, right? Uh, anyways, remember to like the video if you enjoyed it. Share it with all your friends so they can enjoy it too. And of course, remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell for Strange Rebel Gaming so you don't miss the next video. Okay? That's all. I love you all. Bye!